Point guard number 55. Basketball is a big part of my life, so I came here to try to play basketball, and I played. The experience was pretty good. Uh, the, my teammates, they were treating me pretty well, and I love the experience. That's a good question. Uh, my uncle, at first, uh, I'm so thankful to him. He helped me a lot. And uh, Coach La, my coach. He helped me a lot here in the school and out of the school. Not just that, like he teach me some things about the basketball. Demeter's a really good guy. I'm really glad that he uh, he came to the United States. I'm really glad he came to Free State. I'm really glad that he played basketball for Free State. He's a snazzy dresser. He, uh, he wears watches that are, that are really cool. Uh, I always like the earrings that he wears. He's just an all-around nice person. Smart guy, too. Really smart, fun-loving, likable. Girls really dig him. Um, really just an all-around good guy. It's uh, Demetar, he's a good shooter, he can shoot very, he can shoot the ball very well, uh, he can dribble, he has handles, um, let me see, he's, he's, he's not that fast, he's alright, I'll give it to him, he's not faster than me, but he's alright, uh, and I'll say he, he know how to keep the tempo of the game going a lot. He's a very he's he's a team player. I would say uh, he passes the ball when people are open. He knows it. He know how to get people open uh, off the dribble and stuff like that. Well, on defense, uh, Demeter was pretty good. Uh, what Demeter learned, I think, right away was how physical the game was in the United States. I think it took him a little while to adjust to how much pushing and shoving and fouling and hacking and scratching and clawing and whatever else there was in the American game. The European game is much more beautiful. Spaced out, they shoot threes a lot, they, they play very fast paced, it's not all rugged and bogged down and slow like the American game is sometimes. So once Demeter got that figured out and figured out he needed to, to fight back, maybe even cheat a little bit every now and again, he became a much better defensive player.
I'm playing basketball around 10 years and my first coach was Zlatko Zetov, who I love the most. He's my favorite coach. And he actually he teach me how to play basketball. I'm with him from my from second grade. And he teach me how to dribble the ball. He teach me how to shoot. He teach me pretty everything. And I had I had a great time there. The team was called Millennium. We got two times second place. Uh, 2007, 2010, and I don't want to forget coach uh, Dra Drago Yankov. He, he was my second coach, and but he's like great person, great coach. Everything, everything the best for him. On offense, Demeter has a serious flair to his game. He likes the behind the back pass. He likes the no look pass. He likes the jump pass. He does a lot, a lot of uh, what we call kind of crazy things. But I know in in Demeter's world, that's kind of how the game gets played with a lot of flash and a lot of style. Uh, so it took us a while to adjust to that, and it took a while to, for Demeter to adjust to us a little bit. But when he did, the thing I'll never forget about Demeter was when we got him in the game against Leavenworth. And late in the game, uh, when we were trying to come back, Demeter made a huge three from the corner, guarded, kind of a fade away. I'd say it was about 22 feet, nothing but net. And that was probably the highlight of the season for Demeter, and uh, almost gave us a chance to win that game. Uh, the Leavenworth game versus Free State, that was a pretty exciting game for Demitar. Um, you know, coach used him a lot in that game for defense and offense. Uh, he came in with like 20 seconds left. It was a big game. We needed some points and he uh, knocked down a three in the corner for us and tied the game up. That was pretty pretty good, motivating for us. And But we still ended up losing by one, which was not so good. Definitely my favorite game was uh, Free State versus Leavenworth. And it was a pretty good game. We were losing like all whole time, and on the end, uh, I think it was 20 seconds before the end, and I scored three point shots from the corner, and the game got tied. But on the end, we lost by one. But still, it was it was a pretty good game. I like this game. Most people ask me if I want to be taller and I'm saying no, I mean I don't want to be taller, like everything has opportunity, like I'm not tall but like I'm faster, I can dribble the ball faster, I have more control um, and the basketball, basketball comes from, from the heart, if you work hard you can have some results, you, have, you can have uh, good results, so yeah, it doesn't matter if you're tall or short.